For more than a year, doctors, pharmacies, and patients have struggled with getting medication to treat ADHD. Our Stephanie Quirk has more on how pharmacies in southeastern Wisconsin are having to adapt and why the shortage continues. If you are prescribed a medication, you might not think twice about whether or not the pharmacy will be able to get it filled. People living with attention deficit disorder don't have that luxury. We get phone calls, do you have this in stock? The FDA announced a nationwide shortage of Adderall in October of 2022. It's one of the drugs used to treat people with ADHD. It helps them to focus in school and stuff like that, so um, it really does make a difference. John Phillips with Sage Specialty Pharmacy says even now it's a struggle to find any ADHD medications. Five ants, um, these focal and one uh, mom has a patient every week, you know, and, and I'm saying I, I, it's still not available from anybody. The question is why? Fox 6's Jason Calvi asked the U.S. Secretary of Health and Human Services in D.C. Here's what's missing. The industry commitment to get from that point A all the way to that point Z without a crisis. The FDA blames supply chain issues and an increase in prescriptions during the pandemic. The demand for those medicines is there. While there's no timeline for when the shortage will end. Communicate as much as we can with our patients that are, are using these medications. In Wisconsin, Stephanie Quirk, Fox 6 News. The National Community Pharmacists Association says roughly 87% of pharmacies are reporting shortages of ADHD medications as of this year.